we are back with Valen in Dorel, and uh, we've got a couple things to do today. I think the first thing is uh, we need to eat. We are hungry. Let's see. You are a vampire. You have not fed in a while. So we need to make sure we eat. Um, we're going to have to eat more often right now because uh, we're, uh, our blood metabolism is low. I think uh, we need to make sure to eat every 12 hours. So we're going to be hunting for a meal. So we're picky. But at the same time, we'll eat who we can, not eat, drink who we can. Vampires don't eat people, they drink their blood. We are not cannibals of Namira. We are polished, high fashion, gothic vampires. He, he, he is, to me, a, a kind of a gothic vampire feel to him. So we're going to be hunting around, looking for someone that we can, uh, we can, uh, drink their blood. Let's see. Oh, I don't have vampire seduction. Hmm. What to do, what to do. Okay, until then, we have another quest. And it is to, it is, uh, we'd received a... A uh, barrel of Blackbriar Mead from a Dark Elf, and he is actually skimming from Maven. So that's a giant problem. So we're going to report him. Um, we are loyal to Maven. So we're going to go to the Bee and Barb. Not the Bee and the Barb, the Blackbriar Meadery. And we are going to look for this guy. Uh, show to in in Darren is that his name attention to employees let's read this uh, noticed all employees lady black has requested that all employees subject to random searches at my uh, discretion there's been a rash of missing meat barrels lately and won't tolerate it any longer any employees caught with the merchandise belonging to lady black will be subject to immediate uh, in uh, in in, what is that? In car in incarceration, my bad. Incarceration or rift in jail. Oof, you don't get fired, you get thrown in jail. Jeez. If you have any objection to this position, feel free to remove yourself from the metery permanently. Alright, so that's who we're reporting to. So Hey, don't look at me that way. So what Ooh. Have a is it nope, I don't have my power back. Is what it is. On these lower levels, we're gonna struggle a little bit, trying to um, get back where we need to. You see that gold over there? We're. It's funny. Even though we're gonna be doing thieves guild quests, we're not really a thief. We're pretty honorable for a vampire. I've been contemplating this character. And what his, it's going to get really bright as soon as we step outside. Uh, what his mentality is. And kind of kind of how he perceives mortals. Where is this guy? Yeah, we're not doing any of those fishing quests. Um, look, a flying fish. Okay. Everything all right? So, I think Velen, an older vampire, one that enforces vampiric law. Oh, there he is. Good sir. Hmm. Uh, did you know uh, Romlin is skimming from the metery? Ah, I suspected as much, but I've never been able to catch that little sneak with proof. He gave me this keg t to deliver. That fetcher. I gave him the same keg just this morning and told him to store it in the cellars. Oh, he'll rot in prison for this one, I promise you. As soon as Maven finds out, it's all over for him. Here, take
take this as a bit of a reward for nabbing our little thief. Excellent. Well, that was important. What? Well, yeah, it was. Uh, let's throw our hood on. Um, because don't like those eyes. I like the I like our There's the way he looks, but oh yes, there is. My husband Bercy will be the death of me. All right. He spends Welcome too much time to worried about Rifton and not enough about What himself. can I do for you? I have all Are you not it's open yet? Why, why is your door open? Okay, let's talk about um, the mentality of um, Savak. Not Savak. Jeez, I've got so many characters running. Velen. Um, Velen, he is about... If you guys have seen Lion King and heard the speech that Mufasa gives to Simba about talking the circle of life and, um, you know, how the gazelle have a place and how the lions eat think we need their laws? the gazelle, um, that's how he kind of looks at the, the uh, humans, the mortals, is uh, there's a place for them um, and they serve a purpose. Um, they're not bad. Um, in fact, they're they're good in some sense. They serve a purpose, um, and they can be very helpful. But the vampires eat them, and so he's just accepting of this process. So, and and he doesn't do it with malice. I don't think he kills. Um, and in fact, he might not. He might even go as far to try not to kill. Um, push come to shove. Um, there's just no reason for it. So, um, he's, if you guys have seen, uh, the Hasim vampire, he's a very different vampire mentality wise, but he's also very different skill wise because he's from a different clan. Um, the way I'm able to do that is with mods. And so, um, Hasim is not a Volkahar vampire. He is a vampire called a, he's a vampire from the, uh, vampire, uh, I think it's called the, it's a Cyrodiilic vampire order which supposedly i don't know if they're the strong the literal strongest vampires but i think that they're, they're they're the most political and most influential which i guess you could theoretically say then that makes them the strongest man we need to eat there's just nothing we can do though i don't know how to eat any other way we don't have vampiric vampire vampiric will or vampiric command yet um, a lot of these things will open up to us when we, or do we have them? A lot of this is just RP on my end, whether I want to use these things yet. Um, hmm. That is this thing that's frustrating. Your skin's as pale as a snow. Well, um, is vampiric oh, seduction that's isn't so available. Bad. Um, where you can only use it once a day. So, oh yeah, we gotta study this spell. Uh, we will be doing, um, soul gems. We'll be trying to get souls. So, we don't need that. We'll sell this. Um, yeah, we have an earring. I'll show it to you guys. Looks cool. It fits the character, I feel like. Okay. Until next time. Let's show you what uh, Valen looks. Can can you guys see it? Let's see. Yeah, right there. Yeah, he's uh, he uses this word often, but he is a dapper. What uh, what elf? Dark elf. I also one of my OG favorite races because I am a Morrowind fan. Um, that's my introduction to Elder Scrolls was was uh, Morrowind. I think the third or fourth installment of the Elder Scrolls series. And so I loved the Dun Dunmer uh, race. Um, it's probably one of my favorite. I think High Elves might be my favorite though. I'm really trying not to save often. Um, I think we just need to sleep. I'm afraid though <laughs> What's gonna happen? I've never played with Sacrosanct, bef Sacrosanct before, so we might get so hungry that people start attacking us. 
I don't know. So we're just going to study our Conjure Death Hound. That's going to be very useful for us. Um, and then when nighttime comes, we can uh, find someone to feed on. So rather than just sleeping, we're able to focus on make use of this time. I, I do want to look at the quest, though, to see if there's anything we can start focusing on. Oh, we could look at this. We also have a mod for another version of this, the gray, gray fox cow. So, uh, the bloodstone chalice. Uh, we've not started that. Sinister Seven, that's going to be something that's interesting. Since we are a vampire knight, there are assassins that are after us. Um, that's just the price we pay for being... Uh, doing what we do vocationally um, so other clans send out assassins to hunt us um, so all right we're starting to get tired all right has our vampire no it's still not out that sucks all right let's sleep a little bit I'm still getting the hang of this uh, mod setup too Still nothing. Alright, well, that's okay. Because I'm sure people are sleeping at this point. And let's pray to old Boethia. I probably shouldn't have called her old. Her. Um, Alright, we're going to look for someone yeah. to drink. And I think we might start to some Thieves Guild quests. Ooh, it is dark. But not for us. Mm. Is anyone around? Okay. Oh, come on. Come on. I sometimes get creeped out being a vampire. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. No! Oh, jeez. Oh, looks like we're going to have to feed on some of the riffraff at the uh, at this establishment over here. Take my advice. Stay at the b and bar. The bunkhouse is all right. I don't think it is for, for us either, but we have to make do with the circumstances we have. Excellent. Lots of people to feed on. All right, let's see. Dark elves. Lots of dark elves. This is what we'd probably... You know what? Let's... Okay, let's go quick. Oh, that's all we have is drained lethal? Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Uh, shoot. I don't want to kill any of them. Oh no. Oh no. I don't know what to do. Wait, do I have any blood potions? Oh, I know what to do. I hope you're not planning on picking my pocket. No. Keep your hands to yourself. All right. I know what to do. I know what to do. And I'm going to feel really bad for doing this, but, um, ooh, it's snowing. Love the snow. Um, it would be a giant masquerade breach to kill someone in town, especially, um, when we are working for Maven. Um, she's not going to appreciate that. So, there is a thrall down in here. We'll, uh, we'll kill him. Feel bad about it. Hopefully they can snag another individual. Um, okay, so it's right here. Hey, you got your clothes on. What do you have? Look. 
All right, so we need to remember this guy. We can sell stuff to him. Um, and we can buy those blood potions too. In fact, if we could just buy one of those wow. blood potions, Take a look. maybe that can... Okay, that might have been a total waste of money, but Next time. maybe not. Uh, are we good? Let's see. We're sated. Great! Alright, I would have felt really, really bad um, killing one of these thralls. We're gonna drink on them, though. Let me go! Where am I? So, I think one thing that we're gonna try is doing a lethal drain on one of the guards in the bunkhouse. Because I think that's the only way we can unlock our, um, some of our vampiric hemomancy spells. So, I think. Alright. So, we feel good that we helped out Maven. Um. We did our job, but the only reason we're helping Maven in the first place is for Lord Harkon. So, let's see what time it is. 1.51? Okay. Hope you guys are having a great day. Thief, where? Where is he? We'll help out. Alright, I need to be careful not to hit any of the guards. Okay. Yes, we needed more lockpicks. Okay. We're going to go into the guards guard area. Let's see. Night walk. Send forth a mist. 20 seconds use again to teleport to its location okay uh, oh we have vampire seduction won't use that yet though we'll have to hold on to that and be a little bit more choice about who we use that on so we don't feel bad for killing one of the guards um, their guards this is what they signed up for um, not to be killed by me but they're putting their life on the line it's normal for something like this to happen not normal all right okay yeah we got blood seed started something else drain victim all right, Johnny, it's, yeah, you sleep good. Yeah, yeah, it, everything's, um, okay, that's super awkward. Um, no, no trouble at all. <laughs> okay, so we got blood seed, so let's look at this. Jagged bone shards grow in a living or undead target, dealing six magic damage for ten, uh, ten seconds. So, I wonder if Drain Lethal, all it does is increase the rank quicker. So maybe that wasn't necessary. But, here is a cool thing that Drain Lethal does do. I'll show you. Um, let's do... Let's do magic. Because we're going to use a lot of magic. Now look. One point, one point, one point. Everything's 151, 151, 161. Why is that? When I do Drain Lethal, I get one bump of permanent increase. So, I don't know if I'll do that often. But when I can, I will. So, we'll throw that there. And, um, we will do one-handed. We need to find a shield too. Um, I might download a mod that would look good with this 
set up. Um, all right, what did we decide to do? All right, so we need to read that note from that thief's body. Um, also, I'll say this. We're going to repeat some quests with this character that we've done with Hasim. Uh, a lot of the better vampire stuff, their weapons, and uh, he would have foreknowledge of those areas, Cold, Cold Haven, whatnot, so he will do some of those quests. The fox told me he wore the gray cow to forget himself and start a new life, yet I am the one who can't remember every time we meet he's a stranger to me, or was it a she? It doesn't matter. I spoke his words to a beggar and told her shadow hide you. She slipped me a note that confirms my suspicions. The gray fox is dead. And now that I've seen his headstone, I know for a fact his time is over and the cow will be passed on. I'm going to be the next one to wear it. Ooh, maybe not so much. And when I do, I'll become so rich, I won't need any memories. I'll just buy new ones. Okay. So this speak to the code phrase, speak the code phrase to a beggar. Okay. So why not pursue this? We are all about finding artifacts and growing. I like being able to move around like this as well. I want to see how many people I've killed. 17. We might do some hunting in our vampire lord form. Okay. Nope. Sure, sure. I'm a dirty beggar. Why would you want to even speak to me? Of course. Read the stranger's note. Stranger's letter. Strangers, no, okay. Uh, I can't see. You're here about a job. You don't know what it is, what it's for, but I'm sure you're, you're intrigued. It's all right. You don't need to know anything just bet, just yet. There's a st strong box in Bowley's house placed on a dresser next to his bed. Find a way to crack it open. Your instructions for the job are inside. A stranger. Okay. So, we need to remember this area too. This is a good area for us to feed. They are... I don't want to call them disgusting, but they're uh, not exactly high-end meals. They're beggars. Um, that being said, um, this character, though he ha has probably lived a lavish lifestyle he is a man of the military uh he's a knight a vampiric knight and so it's not unusual for him to um you know eat what he can when he can he's he is a uh he's he he is special forces so um Ooh, let's use that blood seed spell, shall we? Okay. Okay. Very cool. Um, let's see how much time do we have? Uh, all right. We're gonna go to that castle over there. So let's see. get over here I think the next spell that we end up taking not spell but perk will be something in our vampiric athletics tree um, that will allow us to run a little faster he will start running faster jumping higher doing all that fun stuff all right we're going to save before we you are going to feast on some delicious delicious bandits I love flying with this character I'm thinking actually about doing a video where uh, Valen just flies over Skyrim doing kind of like a just chill video to some cool music and us just flying over all 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 of the more beautiful parts of um, 
Skyrim. He's going to be able to get to places a lot quicker than a lot uh, all my other characters, too. Oh, no. Alright. See, that was the nice thing about being able to fly. I was about to die. Not die, but I was going to fall. But I uh, could fly, so I just... Ooh. Hello. Where is, uh, okay. <laughs> I was having all kinds of problems. Gotcha. And then we'll get the ones up there. I might stay here for, for the night. Ooh, watch out. Okay. They're still throwing down. Here, we'll help you guys out. Alright. I am running a mod that uh, boosts up a lot of the damage that the Vampire Lord does. Um, and WoW does it. Yeah, I am. Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 oh. This is not good. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. oh I got a little cocky with that one. Go, 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 go. Oof. Um, yeah. We're not as powerful as, uh, I like to be but we're not we're not a pushover either um, let's see what time is it yeah we still need to do some hunting regardless of how we're doing we need to push forward if I die I'm gonna lose 500 gold this is just a little rule that I play with so, okay all right we need you Ooh, what Okay, good. Arise. No, 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 no. Okay. Try not to hit the crawl. Oh, great. Oh. Alright, that's 500 gold, Leo. Oh, no. Oh, cool. Well, that was a special ability. Oh, no. That might have been totally pointless for us to use. Come on. Oh, great. Come on, move, 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 move. Move, move, move. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, this is super stressful. Oh! Oh! I'm still learning how to use this. Well, lessons have been learned. First of all, I had a little bit of a crash. No big deal. But the thing that I'm realizing is even though I am a lion among sheep, I still can get swarmed and killed. And I have to be careful when we're in close quarters uh, because, well, I can die. So I owe 500 gold. Uh, we'll take care of this right now. So you guys can see I'm uh, not cheating. This is uh, how I dox myself. It's, you know, it's just something that that I do. So we're going to go TGM. Hopefully we have, oh, we don't even have 
500 gold. So this sucks. Gold is very important to us. But if I don't want to lo lose this, well then I should just not die. That seems fair, right? So, alright. Well, I thank you guys for watching. And I will see you in the next episode.